looks like. The gang's assembled and are in position to help you get up to that vault. For the rest of the operation, you are the ball. Roger, Bentley. I'm starting my approach. Getting over these fortress walls shouldn't be a problem. Look, we're running five by five here. Make sure everyone's in sync. I hear that. Artillery, sure you can make that shot? I endeavor not to miss. Excellent. Radio control. In position. Recovery team. On pump. Submersibles. Showtime, baby. Telekinetics. I die, I die. All right, it's the crime of the century and the ball's in motion. Requesting door via Agent Monarch. Over. Launching. Stand clear. I've got visual confirmation on the door. Nice shooting. Be advised, Paul is nearing the lab. Agent Deep Six, you ready? Be a gun loaded. your wife doing, Richards? Oh, very well, Dr. M. Thank you for asking. Very thoughtful. Mm -hmm. And your son, uh, what's his name, Mike? Mark, sir. He, he's well, too, yeah? It's a shame you won't be seeing them again. Ah, uh, sir? Afraid I poisoned your drink at lunch. Sorry, Richards, but I don't tolerate poor performance. You should have changed the security code from one, two, three after you installed the new system. I'll improve, mm -hmm. I swear. No, you'll die any second now. Oh. 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 Yes, water leaking into the lab. I'm on my way down. Oh, and get a janitor for the lab elevator. Richards got sloppy. Cooper Malt is just across these wires. I'm en route to your position for the loot hall. Over.
be Sly Cooper, the new keeper of the cane. Oh, how I long for this. This vault belongs to the Cooper family. You're trespassing. No, my naive boy, you're trespassing. I've got the deed to this island. This fortress is mine. Everything here is mine, which now includes the key to the vault. Hand over that cane. Sorry, pal. Family heirloom. Buy a knockoff at the gift shop. Quick, let's regroup with the others. Follow me. Hurry! I can't let you bleed. You be done for it! Escape, Koopa. I can't let you leave. You belong to me. He's gonna eat me! Fly! It's not working! Save yourself! If he wants to eat, eat this! Like they always say, your life really does flash before your eyes. There it all was, stretching back to my childhood. Born into a family of master thieves that went back for generations, I was next in line to continue the Cooper name. But fate had different plans. I was robbed of my childhood when a ruthless gang attacked our home. The orphanage I landed in wasn't all bad. It was there that I met my lifelong friends. Bentley, he's always been the thinker. And Murray, he's the doer. We'd stuck together over the years, and our skill, our confidence, and our thieving reputation grew stronger with each heist. We thought that the good times would never end, and that our luck would never run out. Which only made things tougher when the odds finally caught up with us. Then I met this guy, McSweeney, who claimed to have run with my father's crew back in their heyday. They pulled jobs all over the world and amassed quite a collection of priceless items. It was then that McSweeney told me all about the Cooper Vault. It seemed that my father, like all my ancestors, had been hiding their wealth in a secret place for generations, each one adding to the treasure hidden behind a door that if McSweeney's story is true, only a Cooper can open. Using some well-placed clues provided by McSweeney, we set out for the secret island that held the vault. On arriving, we discovered someone by the name of Dr. M had already set up shop. From the looks of it, he'd been trying to crack the thing for years, growing steadily more frustrated in his failures and more paranoid as the decades rolled by. He built himself a fortress with security as tight as Fort Knox. Getting inside the place would take precision, creativity, and moreover, it would take an army of world-class thieves. Finding and bringing together that much talent won't be easy, 
But to get inside the Cooper vault and collect my inheritance, I was willing to pay the price. Thank <laughs> you.